Welcome to a new video by the Sea and Coast. In today's video, we're going to know about the motions of a ship in the water. We all have seen crazy videos and glimpses of ships and its members inside facing rough water stumbling over from one side to another. Or if you've been to a ship, you must have experienced it too. So is it just about the moving of the ship with the waters? Well, if we look closely, these motions of ships can be classified into two types, transverse and rotational where transverse means movement along a particular line, whereas rotational means rotation along an axis of rotation. Now, if we go deeper and consider a graphical explanation in transverse movements, when the ship moves up and down about the z-axis, this type of movement is called heave. When the ship moves sideways from one side to another along, let's say, the y-axis, it's known as sway. You must have seen this motion in the movie Titanic. And when the ship slows down and moves forward in sudden jerks along the x-axis, it is known as surge. Having discussed all the three types of transverse motions, we now come to the rotational type of motions, where if the ship rotates about an imaginary line considered along its length, it is known as rolling because if we look at the ship from its front, it looks like as if the ship is rolling over the waters. If the ship rotates about an axis along its width, it is known as pitching. And finally, if the ship rotates about a vertical line, let's say the z-axis, it is known as yawing. This kind of motion usually tends to change the direction in which the head of the ship moves. Now that we know the six different types of motions of a ship, we come to an end of this video. See you in the next one.